Hello everybody and welcome to Slime Rancher 2. Now, I hope everybody watched the series I did on the first game because um, I thought it was really fun to play. Um, but this is the second one and I'm hoping it's going to be a little bit different, but I'm assuming it's going to be pretty much the same thing. Um, right off the bat we get our first corral. We got this cool little Idrisil tree here. And we've got all the walls of plorts. <clears throat> Sorry. We've got the wall of plorts. And I'm not 100% sure what all of them are, but from the trailer that I saw, this is probably the bunny one. We got like the phosphor, we got some of these other things, boom, water, fire. We got some new ones, this one, this one, this one, that one. The gold one looks the same. Um, and it looks like down here, we also have a little cave system that leads us straight to our refinery. Now, it looks like, yeah, it's just the refinery. We have strange diamonds, radiant ores, jelly stones, and everything like that. Now, these are these strange diamonds and radiant ores. Those are different in this game, um, and everything else seems to be um, accurate. And right here, we have the fabricator. Um, seems to be pretty similar to the one that we have before, except it takes pink plorts, boom plorts, tabby plorts, and etc. in order to be able to upgrade our people. Um, how did I get down here? I got down this way, so we can go this way. Um, there's a couple other places we can go. Over here we have absolutely nothing. Um, there might be something right there. I don't know where I am on the map. Right here, I might have to check that out up top. Um, just to see if there's anything going on. But for right now, what we're going to do is we're going to go back out, and we're going to go straight out the front door, and we're going to just go and find ourselves some new slimes. Because we've seen the pink, we've seen the rock, we've seen the tabbies and all those other things, but what we want to see are the new ones. Alright, so right out the gate, we've got the rainbow field, shifting colors like a dream, fading just as quickly. Looks like we've got some pogo fruit right here. Um, can't go wrong with some pogo fruit. I wonder what kind of other... Um, uh, vegetables and fruits and things that they have in this game. Now, I could keep some of these pink pink slimes, but I really, they're, they're probably just not worth it. I have absolutely no idea what this thing is. Um, but, oh, oh, there's the bunny. Oh, we got one. The cotton slime. A hot, a hop, skip, a jump, and oh, it's gone. <laughs> That's kind of funny. So we're going to grab some of these, well, we're also going to grab carrots. Surely the cotton slimes like, uh, vegetables. Yeah, I saw it sniffing those carrots. How would they not like them? So we're going to gather up some of these guys. Um, I don't know. We're actually going to check out the uh, Slimepedia. Now, I do not like the new UI for this game. Um, carrot. Carrot. They like, they like blueberries. I don't know. But it looks like they like vegetables. So, whatever that means. Alright, I think that looks pretty good for right now. We got 16 or 17. Oh. Now we got 17 in the corral. Eh, I think that'll be fine. I'm sure they won't jump out. Oh, hey, what's this little guy? He looks happy. He's like a little bug. Looks like accessing Gigi's log. So this is kind of like H's log from the first game. You guys can read that if you'd like. But there's my house, just so you guys can see where that is. Hello? Who are you? Little phosphor gordo. Yeah, I got some. I got some. I got some pogo fruit for you, and a little bit of cube berries. I know you like those cube berries very so much. Doesn't look like I had 20. Probably takes 20. I can't really see what's behind it, but I'll be right back. I gotta go get some more fruit. Well, hold on a second. I'm just out here looking around for some more fruits, and here I find a little cotton, cotton gordo. I've got a few carrots for you. Oh, don't eat that. Yeah, I got a few for you. I think I thought that was about 20, but I guess not. <clears throat> Luckily, there's a few more carrots right here that you might enjoy. Looks like we're going to need some more for you. I don't know where you are on the map. Oh, it looks like it pins them. Okay, that's not too bad. Okay, we'll be back for you, little cotton gordo. That is not looking good. So here's the little cotton gordo right here. But it does look like that there's the new plant right here. Yep, these are the blueberries that I was talking about earlier. This is water lettuce. And I got the map. Or at least this section of the map, which I would say is a success. Oh, that's that map, so it's just actually like, you can actually see them from right here. If you were to keep an eye out. Just in case anybody wanted to know where it was. Oh ho ho! Look what else I found. Another GG's log. Again, you can read that if you'd like. Um, it looks like it was just saying that uh, he put some of these fabricators around. In fact, I think we're going to miss completely at point blank range. I was going to say, I think I'm going to just take advantage of it and put those in there right now. 
I'm hoping... Oh, look, there's another map thing. Um, and I do not know what that is. Looks kind of like a UFO. Uh, Alright, Cotton Gordo. Get ready to be fed. There, that's what I thought. Bloop. Gordo slimes. Aw, they're adorable. What's down here? Oh, look. It's like a toy. Oh, or it's a... Uh, or it's not a toy. <laughs> Uh, should I just... I'm just gonna get rid of these guys. We don't need them, right? Ooh, little pony foo-foo. And I don't actually need these, uh... I actually don't need these things either. Because I got some growing. I'm curious where this is gonna lead me. Whoa, activate. What's it gonna activate? I'm gonna blow up the mountain. <laughs> I'll go with that. Oh, it's up there. That. Now that's wild. I wish it would focus a little bit better. It's a little blurry from where I'm standing. I might need glasses. I'm gonna go check it out. Actually, no. I'm gonna go over to the other gordo first. Alright, Phosphor. How many licks is it gonna take to get to the center of the Tootsie Pop? Just a few more. Alright, we'll get rid of that guy. We got the Phosphor Slime. We don't need any of those guys, though, because we can't sustain them anywhere. You guys can go out there and burn. Also, we got these things, and it says that you can upgrade to harvest it. I'm guessing this is like the jelly stone. Um, I think that's what it's called. Um, we got... We got a little bidet. Well, that's kind of cool. Cleanliness is always key. Um, and it looks like... I... I don't know what plort that is. Might be... It might be a bat plort. I, I know that there's bats in this game. Alright. Well, we'll have to come back for that. Um, but for right now, let's go see what that teleporter did. At least I assume it's a teleporter. Okay. Well, I may have gotten lost trying to find the teleporter, but I was able to find this guy. And uh, luckily I've got 40 carrots and fruit on me. I don't know how many it takes. Maybe 30? Yep, 30. Looking good. Oh, there's the ball thing. I guess this is like the new chest. But it actually looks like it's some type of geyser. I don't suggest uh, if you ever go to like Yellowstone or something, do not jump on a geyser. It is uh, not going to be your friend. But that was pretty cool. I like that mechanic. Big fan of that, not a fan of the UI, because this is bad. But I am a big fan of that. I also, if you notice, day three, uh, I may or may not have gotten knocked out for a while. It's okay, I might have fallen to the water, but it's fine. Also, looks like we got another one of these things, and oh my god, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go for it. I, I need to see this. Up close and personal. That is so... Cool. This might be... Now, if it is a teleporter, which I'm just assuming it is, this has got to be cooler than the glass does a teleporter. The other one was bigger, but this one was... This one was just an experience, you know? Also, this thing, I just assume is going to be the thing that allows me to just suck up water. Also, what's down here? Nothing? Ooh! A little 7Z club thing. Nice little useless upgrade. Love that. Alright, let's go through the portal. See what happens. We'll just go through this. Can I hit M? Oh, actually, it does. Yeah, my bad. I went right instead of left, but I found the Gordos. That was fine. Um, yeah, so this one's going to take me over here to that cloud, and this one's going to take me over to this cloud, and maybe there'll be another one over here or something. I don't know. Let's jump through and see what happens. All right, we're in the Ember Valley. The ancient world stares beneath your feet with every step. I'm not 100% sure exactly what that means, but I probably don't want these in my inventory, because I'm sure I'm going to find some better plorts around here somewhere. Uh, do I go down? Yeah, I'm just going to go down. Alright, so far I haven't seen anything of note. Seen a few tabbies around, but I saw some tabbies in the, uh, the rainbow area. Also, always gathering food. You never know when you're going to find a gordo. Um, I have no idea what's going to be spawning around here. I already have 20 of those. 
Oh, here we go. Let's grab one of these. Oh, I want one of... Oh, crap. Where are the freaking these stupid things? I want the... I don't really want the odd onion. We'll always find... Oh! Oh, you! You, I want you. I want the angler slime. Not... No, get rid of the heartbeat. I want to see what it has to say about the angler... The angler fish. Stupid odd onion. I don't want to hear it. Oh. Angler slime. So, so pretty. Let me get a little... Let me just get a closer. So I'm guessing these guys are going to need a pond. Um, they might not need a pond. I'm guessing they're going to need a pond. But it does look like they can... They can combine with other things. Also, what are you... Okay, I don't need two carrots. What are you? A sea hen. Lovable trash. Like your favorite bad movie. Oh, well that was a little below the belt. That's okay. Oh, look at the plort! The plort has a little thing on it. Also, the sea hen's green. Weird. Also, I'm grabbing as many of these guys as possible. It also doesn't look like they need a... Ew. That is disgusting. Look at that. That is so pretty. Have I talked about how pretty this game is? Especially at night time. This game is just absolutely gorgeous. But, like, right now, with, like, the flowers and the anglers and the water and stuff, it is just so cool. I should get back home before I, like, accidentally kill myself. You know, I thought I knew how to get out of here. I was going over towards this thing, and then I just kind of got trapped under water? What the heck? I'm grabbing more of you, though. More, I need at least ten. Oh! <gasps> Look at you! Oh, I, I want to drop... Oh, no. I want to... I dropped the... I'm dropping the fruit. We don't need them. We don't need the fruit. We want the bat. We want the bat. Batty slime. That was a lot of fruit I just dropped. That was 20 fruit. I'll oh, get out of here. Oh my gosh, I, I, I don't want to... I, okay, I can't die now. I, I I don't even know where I am. Look at the patty slime. They eat fruit. Oh, I just got rid of all my fruit. <gasps> What's their favorite fruit? I should come home with it. I can drop the... I can drop the heartbeat. I can drop the heartbeat in a heartbeat. I have no idea where I am. Does it... Can I can I read what the, what the bat is? Bat, 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 bat. Okay, they like okay, they like the hen, hen the the sea hen. I don't want to give them meat. I think that's a bad idea. I hate growing meat. They like fruit. They specifically like the weird black moldy blueberry fruit. Actually, it looks like a kind of looks like a pogo pogo fruit in like encased in rocks. I have no idea. Oh my gosh, I found a crystal slime. Okay, I don't want I don't want the sea hen. I do want the crystal slime. I have absolutely no idea what's gonna be the best combination of things. So maybe I'll just leave that up to you. Whatever you guys want, I might decide to make, or maybe whatever gives me the best profit in the store. Um, initially. But this is going to give me crystal plorts, it's going to give me bat plorts, it's going to give me angler plorts, and I still don't know how to get back to the entrance. Oh my gosh. Finally, the portal will go back home. Alright guys, here's a tip for you. If you don't have any money, you just take all your slimes and you throw them on top of your crops and you go into your house and you sleep for a couple of hours. I mean a couple of hours, I mean like 12 or a day. You know, kind of like if you're depressed. Um, we're just gonna throw this in here, and we're gonna look. It looks like the bats are worth about 26. I'm just assuming that that's the bat, bat one, because I don't recognize it. The bats are pretty good. The anglers are 28, so those are actually even better. So an angler bat might be super cool. Crystal is 35, so crystal bat might look pretty sick. Might look pretty cool. So I'm, we might do that. We might do like an angler bunny. Angler bunny. I don't know. I just want to I want to experiment with some of these. Like I don't know what this one is. I think I think this one's the butterfly. We've seen the butterfly in the trailers. I think this one might be the raccoon, squirrel, tanuki, lemur. I don't know. This one's something, something like that. Uh hunters are invisible, which is why you never like them that much and they tend to be feral. Either way, 
Uh, yeah. So, I don't know exactly what I'm going to do. I do think I need to make another plot. So I did move all these guys over here. So I, I got rid of this plot. I'm growing those things. I moved them over here. This is high walls and a net. So I can throw the... Uh, oh. Ooh, maybe the crystal should be over on the side. So maybe we do crystal... Crystal bat. And then we give this to him. We give this to you. Eat this. I know you like the odd onion, but I think you'll be fine. And then we're going to... Hello, bat. Mr. Bat. And we are going to feed this to you. I said... Oh, are you going to eat it? Oh, no, he's over here. Mr. Bat. Oh, I'm sorry, Mrs. Bat? There we go. Oh, my gosh. That is terrifying. <laughs> All right, we're just going to throw those guys in here for now, and we're actually going to throw these in here. I know they don't like the heartbeat. I can't remember exactly what likes the heartbeat. I could probably just look real quick. Yeah, the rock, guys. I don't even know why I grabbed the heartbeats. That's okay. Um, will I grow them? These guys like fruit. They like that weird fruit. And fruit are always something good. So I'm going to throw these guys in here for now. Just There's ten of them. I don't think anything bad's going to happen to them. Oh, get down from there. Rascal. And the lettuce is still technically a vegetable, right? So I can actually give you some of these things. And we're going to see what these guys turn into. Come on. Oh my gosh. That is the most adorable thing. <laughs> oh, I think 10 might have been too much. I think 10 might have been too much. Okay, I need to make a farm. Oh, shoot. I need to make... I need to make this a farm. No. Screw the farm. No, I still need a farm. Um, I think what I need to do is I need to make... I need to make high walls. High walls and an air net. Oh, I can't make an air net. Uh... We got plorts somewhere? I need plorts, I need money. Oh, you are some you you're you're something bad. I don't want you. Alright, well I think that's a pretty good place to stop for right now. This was the very first episode. Oh my gosh, stop. No, get back in there. I think this might have been a bad idea. I think I I think this is a bad idea. A bad idea. <laughs> Oh, that's kind of fun, though. I like them. Yeah, let me let me know in the comments if you think I should uh, combine them with something different. Um, I could always go back. Um, and next time, what we'll do is we'll jump over here and we'll see what's on this island. But if you see, I didn't really explore too much, and honestly, I, I kind of got lost trying to get back here, and I circled through this cave, and it was it was a whole fiasco in itself. But like I said, we'll go to the other section and we'll see what we can do. But for right now, I think I'm gonna leave this episode here, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Have a good one.